Today I give you a little bit of bio and history of Enjoy the Silence by Tepeshi Mode, but that's going to come after. There's not going to be a deep analytical um, interpretation of the lyrics, but a summary, rather a summary, because the beginning of this needs to be explained. There is a man out there that is eating his words at the moment, and he is the founder of postmodern jukebox that puts jazz back into pop. And initially, he hated pop. There's more about that as well. His name, and I will give you a bit of background about the person who has created these musicians that always surround a lead singer who comes on, it's usually a female, as, and there's been males, who put their interpretation jazz-wise, 1920s flavor jazz, to a pop song. So that is what Joel Furanzo is going to do with Depeche Mode and enjoy the silent, silence with her vocals and the clarinet. And boy, is it worth watching. In a couple of days, it's garnered over a million views, and I'm not surprised, simply because this jukebox, postmodern jukebox idea, is really taking off. Millions of people have gone on to the website and subscribed because they love jazz music, but also they love the refreshing aspect it's taken with the pop. But initially, the founder did not want anything to do with pop music. He was Scott Bradley, and was, uh, sorry, he is Scott Bradley, a jazz pianist from Hartford, Connecticut, and is building up a massive following, even on YouTube, um, in his new home of New York City, where he's now currently playing in special events, banquets, weddings, that kind of thing but garnering millions of views on YouTube and other social platforms, as well as being a person of repute, because he studied at the Hart School of University of Hartford and was immediately a place in the advanced jazz ensemble. Now, it's hard to believe that a person like, him, like himself didn't initially like pop music and decided to put his jazz twist on it and created what is a very, very successful mini franchise for himself, making a nice bit of money, everybody. But not that I'd bequeath him because that's what we're all on YouTube to do as well. Enjoy the silence, the song that's picked today, um, being sung by Joel, was by the English band Depeche Mode. Recorded in 89, it was released as a second single from the seventh studio album, Violator in 1990. The single is certified gold in the US and Germany, and the song won Best British Single at the 1991 Brit Awards. Enjoy the Silence was re-released as a single in 2004 for Depeche Mode, Remix Project Remixes, and was titled Enjoy the Silence, reinterpreted, or more simply, Enjoy the Silence 04. And if we go on to the impact and legacy of this song, Pitchfork Media ranked Enjoy the Silence number 15 in their list of the top 200 tracks of the 90s, because that's what we're listening to, a 90s song today. And Rolling Stone included it in their list of the 500 best songs of all time, in 2021, which is only a few years ago, at number 415. Moving up, moving up, moving up. Today, the interpretation is a jazz one, a jazz one that you are going to simply adore. I, myself, am going to put my headphones on. I'm also going to come back with a very brief summary of the lyrics because if it was a Depeche Mode video that I or Depeche Mode as some people call as I would normally go into great detail but postmodern jukebox and whom they are about and what they are about which you're going to see is about putting people like Jill Varenzo in the front line doing her clarinet, 1920s jazz interpretation of this song and doing it justice so we don't need to dismember the song. But I will give you a little 
bit about the meaning. The song Enjoy the Silence is about the power of silence, everybody, and its importance to reflect and appreciate the beauty of life. The lyrics that you will hear illustrate the idea that words can be violent and hard to comprehend, while silence can provide a place of tranquility, peace and understanding. And that's all we need to know about the song and that's all we need to know about what's going on here. You know it's a jazz interpretation. I just hope, as much as I love postmodern jukebox, get onto YouTube and subscribe, they're amazing. As much as I love them, I hope you enjoy this. I know you will. That deserves a round of applause so loud and screams so loud that it just brings that whole stage down on top of her. I've got to say, beautiful smile, enjoy the silence by Depeche Mode. Postmodern jukebox, 1920s jazz version is so kick ass. Cole, Joel, you have done a fabulous job of that. Absolutely effortless, effortless. And guys behind 
amazing 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 and the guy with the finger and all of you the piano everything perfectly done and i'm sure Tepesh mode would love love more of their songs to be covered by yourselves guys simply because it just puts a wonderful refreshing twist on it to summarize this video everybody and to finish talking myself those lyrics illustrate the idea that words can be violent as i said before and hard to comprehend while silence can provide a place of tranquility peace and understanding now the chorus states that all ever one needs to be found in one's arms free of the need for unnecessary words that can do more harm than good ultimately what you've just heard is a song that's urging the listener to embrace the power of silence and enjoy its beauty which is what i'm going to leave you to do now thank you for listening take care